During this wheel tutorial, you will learn how to trim excess clay from the base during the plastic stage. Trimming is an important step. It removes extra weight from the bottom of a form and makes it appear more clean and precise. In this cross section, focus your attention on the bottom corners of the foot. The foot skirts away from the wall. Your goal is to learn how to use the wheel and wood trim tool together to remove this extra clay. During this lesson, you will practice trimming the foot right before shaping the rim of your plate. Let's take a closer look at how to use the trimming tool to accomplish this task. For time's sake, I doubled the speed of this part of the video. First, center, open, expand, and compress your clay. Don't forget to safely use your needle tool to check the thickness of your base before expanding. Here, I'm pointing to the extra clay that is skirting away from the wall. This is the clay we want to remove. Hold the trim tool with both hands so that the angled edge of the tool is closest to the clay. Line up the pointed end of the tool with the top of the extra clay where it begins to angle out from the wall. Start the wheel and lightly draw a line over the top of the skirt. For this next step, you will separate the skirt from the base by pushing the tip of the tool through the line to the wheel head. Make sure the edge of the tool is mostly parallel with the wall of your form. Notice that the action creates a donut-like section of clay around the base. The wheel head should be visible between the separated clay and your form. Flip your tool so that the angled edge acts like a knife. Hold the tool firmly with both hands. Angle the tip of the tool towards 9 o'clock on the wheel and slowly turn the wheel. The tip of the tool should follow the path of the exposed wheel located between the form and the separated clay. Here I'm turning the wheel manually to show you the action at a very slow speed. Now I'm using the pedal to rotate the form to remove additional clay. Once the extra clay is removed from the base, you are able to shape the wall of your form. For this lesson, you will be shaping the rim of your plate. Add water to the rim. Positioning your hands at five o'clock, place the pads of the pointer, middle, and ring fingers of the dominant hand on the bottom outside corner of the form. You may use a sponge over these fingers to help you with your pressure. Place the pads of the pointer and middle fingers of your non-dominant hand on the inside bottom corner of the form. Slowly move the inside hand up over the outside hand at a slight angle to stretch and shape the rim of the plate. Don't forget, use your compact posture for maximum control. Compress the base and remove water from your plate one more time. Safely use a wire cutter to separate the plate from the wheel head and cut the plate in half to check your work. The top image is without the extra clay trimmed while the bottom image is with the clay trimmed. Let's watch the process multiple times from different angles.
Can you trim the extra clay from your base to create a nice, clean, and precise foot for your plate? Get to wheeling.